ce The snow seems really fantastic in Oz. I've just swung in from the Continent, and the snow commuter here tell me I really missed something Queen's birthday weekend. I blew across to Europa, correction, Europe, about six months ago to do a bit of business for the old man, landed at Napoli, took delivery of an Alpha in Milan over into the snow circuit. Took in most of the Alberg and the Kitzbühel, went over to St. Moritz, swung on to Paris, at correction, swung on to Paris, and finished up the season in Chamonix. I picked up a new pair of white stars, a pair of Scott poles, a few Icelandic beanies, gamma gloves, and a new pair of Ogners. Shipped the car back from Londres, at correction, London, and flew home via the States doing a bit of business for the old man en route, en route. It's an absolute certainty that some of our best snowfields in Oz are on a par with anything I saw on the continent. We've even got the instructors. I skied all over and I didn't strike one continental ski instructor who could better our own Heinz or Helmut up at Buller. When I hit town, I did a bit of business for the old man and then belted up to Buller in the VW Combi with a few great old mates of mine from school. There was Simon Cook, Andrew Fox Russell, Chris Craig and Blair Peyton Smythe. There'd been a good fall, so we got in a bit of fantastic skiing, but Blair's nutcracker slipped on Fanny's finish, and he ended up in Mansfield Hospital with a broken leg. The rest of us blew into the Portsea hut for a few of the old glue vines. Then we all got into our apparatus gear and had a few more at the Bull's Blood Bar, swinging onto the Nomad Lodge for the Brotherhood of St. Lawrence dinner dance. Drew couldn't stay because he had to blow downtown to do a bit of business for his old man, but Simon and I made it with a couple of little snow bunnies. And Chris got shacked up with a fantastic little snow widow whose bloke was downtown picking up a bit of business for his old man. Chris had helped her on the beginner's slope and he reckoned she was a fantastic little performer. Double bunks, but no complications. I was all for doing the circuit and swinging onto Falls Creek and then Threadbow, Parisher, Smiggin Holes and Charlotte Pass. But a couple of the fellas had to pull out and do a bit of business for their old man. And Sue and Sal had a private with Hines and Helmet at five. <coughs> So Roger, Bronwyn, Colin, Trish, uh, Craig, Rabina, Jude and myself took the snow without them. At Falls Creek there was an average depth of eight inches with a village and summer tea bars operating and you haven't skied to try the fry pan. But Threadbow was the greatest with a nine inch fall on Krakenback and that Saturday night was absolutely fantastic. We took in the copper kettle, the Schluss bar and Leo's, uh, swinging onto the eagle's nest for the Prince Alfred Younger set dinner dance. It was hosted by a great old man of mine from school who lent us his fantastic flat at Windy Corner while he blew downtown to put in an appearance at his old man's business. So we all shacked up there with stacks of the old glue vine, a few crates tinnies, a uh, couple of little snow bunnies, and no complications. Uh, me and a few great old mates of mine from school will be getting into our penguin gear and gunning it up there again next weekend for the dinner dance for mentally retarded children. Believe you me, it's a great life up there amongst the snow community and you can really have a ball no matter which of the major schools you went to particularly if you're lucky enough to get snowed in with a stack of glue vine, a few crates of tinnies, a couple of little snow bunnies, and no complications. Every season up we go, Simon, Ross and Stephen. Spearing up here to the snow, deep and crisp and even. We kicked up with a liquid lunch, though the frost was cruel. Drinking glue vine with a bunch of beauty young blokes from school. But we weren't in the mood to bash the slopes, the weather got hot and sunny. So we steamed to the huts to go the grope With some little raving bunny Tone and Russell, Drew and Bruce Sue and Sal and Jude Drank vodka and tomato juice Then went outside and spewed Bring me glue vine, bring me beer And a crate of ice cold tinnies up we hammer every year in our Volksies and our Minis In some cozy alpine spot, there you're sure to find us Propelling Charlies to the cot With a queue of blokes behind us Buller, Threadbow, Perisher 
and Mount Hussey Osco. When the say goes on the slopes, that's where blokes like us go. If you want to be a man, the pride of our young nation, grab a bird and crack a can in the land of no complication. Oh, every season up we go, Simon, Ross and Stephen. Spearing up here to the snow A deep and a crisp and even Oh, we kick off with a liquid lunch Though the frost be cruel Drinking glue vine with a bunch Of beauty young blokes from school